All right, all right, family. Black power, black power. It's the true power with General Sarasun said he kicked back. Get your mind ready for some information that's guaranteed to be heavy. It's going down, family. Uh, this Sunday, we talking about Christmas Eve. You know, I decided to bring this fire right there on, you know, in the heart. In the heart of your holiday. You see what I'm saying? Where this information would truly resonate. You see that it would truly resonate. And I guarantee you, you know, it's going to be the most advanced, the most shocking, the most informed uh, presentation that you can ever witness on the subject. You understand what I'm saying? You know, did, you know, it ain't nothing but for me to give you a taste. You see, you know, you won't know what the general got cooking in the kitchen. I know what you're talking about. You want to know what, you know, what, what type of information you got for us, Eddie. You know, I already know, man. I've been doing this, uh, this lecture now, man. I've been doing this lecture now almost at least six years straight now. You know what I'm saying? You know, you come right on your holiday. That's how I do. Nigga, I come right to you. I come right on your holiday. I don't give a goddamn. That's when you need it. You see what I'm saying? You up there, you, you got you, you know, you're in there, you got you something to drink, you're eating and shit and everything. You're going to do what you do. Yeah, what's good, family? Yeah. I appreciate all y'all, man, for real. Real talk. You know what I'm saying? But you, we just, you know, I want to I wanna be able to, you know, to manifest. I don't, I don't play. You see what I'm saying? When I when I when I come on the holiday, you know, I know you're gonna have grandmama. I know you're gonna have granddaddy over there. You understand what I'm saying? Aunties and uncles, nephews and nieces, and yeah, I ain't I, I'm I'm gonna do it right. You feel me? I'm gonna rock the house though. It don't make no goddamn difference. You see what I'm saying? That's right. I'm gonna rock the house. I'm gonna wake them up. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm going to plant the seed that's necessary. You see, we got to invigorate our own ancestors. We got to. We got to. That's what it's about. You know what I'm saying? That's where our spirit lie. You know, we can't be no goddamn Viking, goddamn, uh, 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 you know, sp demons and shit and this, that, and the third. We cannot do that. You know, we got to, we got to invigorate our own frequency. You know, ain't nothing wrong with and sharing, you know, with your family. Ain't nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. You see what I'm saying? And so, uh, you know, that's not what it's about. It's, a, it, it's about the symbolisms. Okay? It's about the symbolisms in which we address it. You know, and, and, and de, you know, demented. in all they, you know, very demented. And you act like, you know, because ain't nobody then spoke. Peace to the family. Then, but we're going to talk about it today. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to give you a look, you know, because I ain't going to lie. On, uh, on, on that Sunday, I'm guaranteeing you. I mean, the slides, I, I got, man, and I'm just going to be shooting. Y'all know when you, when you want that, when you want the old school setting, you got to come straight up. Because I don't talk. See, I talk to the audience on uh to like on youtube i talk to y'all that's a different platform i engage with y'all you see uh patreon i'm less engaged you see what i'm saying that's like a mini lecture when i'm on patreon i don't engage i don't engage the audience you see what i'm saying that's because i'm i'm, I'm sticking straight to the information you see what i'm saying Sunday, you know, and so when I'm focused just straight on the information, you see what I'm saying? That's where you, that's where you get prime time. This is prime time too, but this is a different platform. I I must engage. This is the right platform. You know what I'm saying? You got to engage the family. You see what I'm saying? Do you got you know and that's good, that's necessary too. You see, but I can guarantee you like on Sunday, I got at least 3 400 slides. You know what I'm saying? And 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 sh all of them going to take you to the next level. I believe, you know, I believe that to be true. You see what I'm saying? And so we want you, you know, the link is down there. 
And I want you to have the family in there. I don't want you to come, you know, empty handed. You got to bring the family now. And, you know, and I'm anticipating that. So and I know you, you know, say, Seti might say some, you know, I ain't, I ain't going to go above, above and beyond. I know. I know y'all going to be in there with your eggnog and shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to come in there and, you know, granny been the fell out the damn rocking chair and shit. Be like, what the hell did that man say? I know he ain't saying nothing about good Jesus. Timothy, who you didn't brought in here? <laughs> Timothy, you didn't brought this demonic nigga in here to teach against Jesus? <laughs> you done for, nigga. I'm, I'm taking you out the wheel. I'm taking you out the wheel, Timothy. You're going to come in here and, di and disrespect Jesus. Let this man disrespect Jesus like that. Yeah. Yeah, nigga. Matter of fact, you can get up out of here now, nigga. Show Timothy to the door. Show him to the door. He's no longer welcome here. He's a heathen, nigga. <laughs> He's a heathen, nigga. You understand what I'm saying? Let's talk about it, family. Now, nah, this is just a little, you know, couple slides I'm going to show y'all. Matter of fact, let's go straight to this. See, and I'm dealing with this on the other one, but you know, uh, the sinister similarities between S Santa and Satan. Now, I, I, I get to the Saturn. I get to Saturn. I get to that. But at the same time, let's deal with the fact that a lot of you niggas out here don't know, and some of you do, that one of the names of the devil is old Nick. You see, old Nick, and one, and see, I like that slide right there. You see, because it show you, he it, old Nick got Santa face on. You see, you niggas don't want to put, you don't want to peel off that mask. See, and the reality is it's the same way in everyday situations. Don't want to take off the mask. You see, you niggas want to play like you're hard, you don't, you know, you know you're dysfunctional. You know you're dysfunctional. You know it. But you see, he's hiding behind all. He's, you know, he's the deity of deities. But he's Cro-Magnum Neanderthals. We talking about Pan. You can call him Satan, whatever you want to call him. But did you know? And you can see right here, I'll look it up for you. Just so let me make sure I'm in the house. I don't want to. Yeah, I'm clear. Old Nick can mean a, a nickname for Satan. And see, even in that, I'm going to break that down for you because you didn't even hear that. You got to read and shit. And, and if you read it uh, and break it down, you have to break that shit down word for word. You see, old Nick can mean a nickname. Listen to that for Satan because it's right there showing you some nickname. See, you didn't know that. So if you if you say, oh, that's my nickname, nigga, that means that's your satanic being. That's who you are, nigga. That's the that's the demonic side of you. See, Nick is a term for the devil. See? See, you didn't know that. Now you know that old Nick. So when you say nickname, because you got to them, you know, to the pagan Christians, they they say you you got a Christian name, right? You got a Christian name. And then you got a nickname. And that's your that's your demonic side. Usually when a motherfucker got a demonic, yeah, this nigga, this is uh uh two Glock, you know, two two Glock Leroy. You know what I'm saying? You know, he always, you know, you 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 always it's a street name, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Four kilos, you know, that's a nigga nickname, four kilos. You know, and all this shit. You know, you come up with any goddamn name. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, whatever you can think of. Mo murder. You understand? Mo murder, mo. You know what I'm saying? Any goddamn. That's it, it's usually a you know something. You know, for niggas is a demonic. Your rap name. You see what I'm saying? You know, always got to be some you know demonic and you know, murderous and shit. That's your nickname, nigga. That's your satanic name, okay? 
want you to know that a nickname for Santa Claus also Oh Saint Nick. I say, wait a minute. Is that true? And so goddamn it, yes, it's true. Oh Saint Nick. Wait a minute. Here go right here. I'm gonna show you that. You got old Nick and you got old Saint Nick. So it ain't just that they name, you know, in both Satan and see a lot of people say Satan or Santa is an anagram for Satan. Both Santa and Saint Satan is an anagram of Saturn. That's what it is. He's the primordial. Okay. You see, he's the first. And then you got Pan. You like Lu you got Lucifer and Bathomyth and all of them. But Pan is the primordial goat god. He's the first and foremost. And you can't put one before him. You can't do it. Are you going for that? And that's what's wrong with you, nigga. You got to stay in sequence. And then you will understand it in the order that gonna make a complete understanding. You see? And so you see. Here you see all oh, uh Santa Claus, Sinister Claus. You see where he got uh, uh Krampus, Krampus, a bath of milk. And a lot of people don't know they didn't change. You know, you can still see this image. You see a Krampus. Krampus is the motherfucker in uh he's the uh damn it. Jeepers creepers. You see. Jeepers Creepers. That's Krampus. That's exactly who it is. Got the same face, the motherfucking tongue. Come, uh, nah, you, I'll drop that one on another level. I ain't gonna give y'all that, that jewel tonight. You see, I ain't gonna give y'all that jewel tonight. And so you see right here, you see the, the devil in Tom Walker. Uh, and you see down Deacon Grubb and the old Nick. You see in the old Nick. And so, I mean, so not only is the name Santa and Satan interchangeable, you got them, you, you got another level in which the other name, old Nick and old Saint Nick. And so ain't no, and you ain't going to have all these goddamn coincidences. You see, you ain't going to have all these goddamn coincidences. This ain't no goddamn coincidence. You're going to meet on two different levels. You see what I'm saying? You're going to meet on two different damn levels. And both and both symbolisms identify the, the you know the two characters. Damn near the same two characters that we discuss, and you meeting on two different levels, two different names, and you meeting up like that. That don't make no goddamn sense. That's more than suspicious. You see, that's more than suspicious. And so a lot of time, you know, they come, you know, that's how they do. They come with the you know the 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 nice the nice guy shit. That's how they do. They come with the candy and, you know, and that's how they used to teach us back in the day. You know, these motherfuckers would be, you know, trying to kidnap children. They come with the candy canes and shit. They ain't going to pull up on these young motherfuckers today because they'll get popped. You understand what I'm saying? They fuck around and get popped. They pull up and say, you, yeah, motherfucker, go right in May or they fuck around and may show ass, whichever one you see. And so, and so, you know, Oh, uh, you know, we see right there that they meet up, you know, in a demonic, you see, in a demonic energy. It ain't no coincidence. I don't want y'all to think first and foremost that again, Christmas is not ain't got nothing to do with Jesus. And so, I mean, you're pagan in all your practices, you know, and you you can do however the fuck you want to do, but you can you gonna you gonna go to you gonna go to sleep with the truth tonight. You're going to have to go to, you know, you, they say the truth will make you free. You niggas don't want to live by no truth. Y'all don't want to live by no goddamn truth. That's a lie. You read what you want to read in them books. You understand? Everything else you discard. If it's going to open up some truth on your ass and make you look in the mirror, you understand that all the shit that you, you know, involve yourself in, you ain't going to do it. Use a goddamn lie. You ain't going to do it. You a part-time Christian nigga. You see what I'm saying? You're not going to go in there and, and every verse mean the same to you. If it's going to expose you for what the fuck you are, you're going to leave that verse behind. You see, you're going to leave them goddamn verses behind. You see, and so when you're looking at, oh, you know, Santa Claus, Sinister Claus, I call him, uh, yeah, Santa Claus, Sinister Claus. 
You see, this is where Santa Claus come from. This is the Dutch version. San Santa Claus is Anglo, Anglicized Santa Claus. That's his name. So here you got motherfucking a sinner, sin sinister Claus. You understand? This motherfucker sound like he high Hitler. You understand what I'm saying? He 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 might throw up a motherfucking how Hitler. You see what I'm saying? And you look at his hat, and you could tell he got the Dagon hat on. You understand? A Dutch creation comes on December 6th, not the 25th. You see, so you know, it was all about uh uh it was all about Saint Nicholas. It was about Saint Nicholas, because they knew good and goddamn well that there ain't no damn Jesus' birthday on no goddamn 25th. You see, and y'all motherfuckers out there with evergreen trees and ain't no goddamn evergreen trees in no goddamn desert, nigga. Okay, I'm sick of y'all motherfuckers. You understand what I'm saying? How the fuck am Jesus going to walk around in the goddamn snow with some sandals on? Let's make this shit make sense. You see, but you pick and choose the pagan shit you want to involve yourself in. If somebody try to put some African in your face, you ain't going you you ain't going to want to deal with it. I see these niggas. You understand what I'm saying? They ain't going to want to deal with it. And so I, I want family out there to know that first and foremost, and I, I'm going to say this because I, 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 you know, I, I don't want nobody. If you know, it ain't about showing love for your family. If you want to buy your family something, that's that's wonderful. You see, make it count, though. Don't don't, don't buy just shit that they mother, you know, tear up and shit. You understand? Make it count. Ain't nothing wrong with getting your family nothing. Nothing at all. OK, it's the symbolisms in which we do it. We empowering a frequency. You understand what I'm saying? We want to do it collectively where we, when we celebrate that we also empowering our ancestors and empowering the culture so that we can advance in what we doing. We don't want we you know, we do it, but we don't advance in it because at the end of the day, they get the whole basket. Because we got to look at this shit economically. This is goddamn America. This ain't just a free, you know, you just, you know, spin, spin, spin. We got to think outside of that, 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 that reckless paradigm of just spin, 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 spin. We understand what I'm saying? We got to get into some of this capitalism just like they do. Where we can bring in some of that money, spin some, bring some in, bring more in than what we spend, bring far more, more in than what we spend. And bring so much in, uh, you know, and bring so much in that when we do spend, it don't, it, it don't, it don't mean shit. We, we, we could do it. It, it. We got it. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about. Where we can get our hands on that paper that we can invest in our own community and our own families. We need that. We need that. That's a, that's a priority. That's a priority to be able to invest in our own families. So when we when we look at these goddamn holidays, it can't be all about spending. We got to make some money. We got to bring some. Yeah, we got to be able to go to black businesses and put our money in black businesses and divert from these motherfuckers. You see what I'm saying? So we could really celebrate like it's a goddamn holiday. That's what I'm talking about. You know. And we ain't, you know, and, and, and do it for our, and, and cause this, what you doing, they doing it. They understand it. They idolize. These are they, these are they idols. They, these ain't just any kind, kind of characters. Uh, you understand what I'm saying? These is, these is icons of the, of the white community. They love these icons. So not only is they making trillions of dollars, you understand what I'm saying? They got people all over the world. You understand? Bowing down to their icons and so on and so forth. You, you, you tell any one of these niggas about Africa and they'll goddamn, they'll say you a heathen, you a pagan, and this, that, and the third. Santa Claus can come down the chimney anytime. They all right with it. They all right with the Easter Bunny. They all right with the, the little leprechaun. You understand what I'm saying? The lucky charms and shit. They all right with all that. They all right with the white man paganism. You understand what I'm saying? But when we come with African spirituality, they deny it. You see, and that's why we got that is one of the main reasons why we had to bang on this shit. We got to change. We got to, it, it got to be a paradigm shift for our people. You understand? Because we don't understand that this is also magic. This is magic. 
This is goddamn magic, and a spell is being cast over you. Now, that Dagon motherfucker, that's a Mesopotamian God. You see, that's a Mesopotamian God. And though I understand that the Kushites are the founders of, of much of Mesopotamian civilization, I also understand that there was some influx into that. You understand that I'm not all right with at all. You understand what I'm saying? A lot of people, they engage in the Sumerian, and I don't do that. I acknowledge some of the early origins of it. You understand? I document the Egyptian influence and African influence on it, but I leave it there. You see, I, I believe I don't, I'm not into no, 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 no Inkies and all them goddamn gods. I'm not into that. You see, I stick to the continental African or those, you know, and, you know, in, in, in some of the traditions that, you know, I know it's, you know, is pure African traditions. Maybe it might not, uh, be from Africa, it might be from Haiti, or it might be, you know, uh, some traditions from Jamaica or something like that. That, it, you know, I like the, you know, the music, and, you know, I engage in that. There's nothing wrong with that, you know, but I, you know, I don't, you know, I try to stay to that, you know. Some people in the, 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 the Anunnaki's and shit, I don't, I don't fuck with that, you see. And so, uh, you see here, uh, you see here, you see uh, Santa Claus on his horse, and you know, in which he's, you know, he's closer in tradition to Odin. Y'all know this is a Viking religion. We don't, we don't have to deal. Ain't no goddamn uh, Jesus live at no damn North Pole. What kind of shit is that? Ain't no goddamn Jesus at no goddamn. Ain't no Jesus, but Jesus is the sun. You understand what I'm saying? You ain't got no peoples in the ice that venerate no goddamn sun. Where they do that at? You understand what I'm saying? You know, people's in, you know, from the ice, they don't celebrate the sun. You ain't never winning no European pantheon. And I tell y'all this time and time again, and find where the sun is the supreme deity. I don't know which one you discussing, but I can go into the Greek, the Roman, I can go into uh uh the the Viking, which is the probably the three major traditions: the Greek, the Roman, the Viking. You see, and, you know, the first time where they attempted was in Christianity. And that's because they took that from Africa. The root of it, they took from Africa. That's solar worship. But even then, they, they you know, it, it, was, it was not to, you know, uh, actually venerate the sun, but to usurp it because they understood the power in it. And so what they did, they put an anthropomorphic white Jesus over the sun to confuse niggas. You see, and, and niggas is sitting out there, and I know the brother asked me, was I going to do the one about the sun? Is God the sun? I'm going to do that one tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I was going to, st I'm stacking the deck on that, and I will do that tomorrow without hesitation. Is God the sun? One Christian nigga came in, he was upset at me. He said, Jesus ain't the sun. I, I say, I don't see how you don't see it. You see, I don't, I don't see how you don't see that, brother. And I believe after, you know, for a minute, you know, he was shook. You know, you know, they, they shook about that, you know, but it's real that God is the son to ask you in and that the Christians have. And when you go anywhere into Catholicism and they say it in the Bible, too, because they say the Catholics is something different than Christians, you see. And so, you know, they try to get but you can go right in the Bible and verify it, too. So it ain't just cause the Catholics, nigga, it's the Protestants, too. They do some of the same shit. You know what I'm saying? With the with the. uh with the uh the halos behind the head you see and so you see here you see old sinister claws you see the day gone you see the day gone and so you sitting up there you will come out there and you will be sitting up here thinking this shit got something to do with christianity it ain't even got nothing to do with no goddamn christianity this is some sumerian bullshit you know what i'm saying i'm just gonna be 100 with you I'm just going to be 100 with you. I ain't going to, I ain't going to hold you up. You know, you can see the symbol. You see right here. You know, you can see the fish eye right there. You see the eye right there. They got the eye right there. You see, you can see the two damn eyes on the fish. That's what it is. And you sitting up here talking about this from Christian. And then nigga, this day gone, this day gone, this Mesopotamian, uh, 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 uh witchcraft. 
You see what I'm saying? And you sitting in here talking, and, and you got all them crazy ass demons like Pazuzu and all that shit that they had in Exorcist. You know what I'm saying? But they warned them motherfuckers on that movie. They say, look, you understand? Leave that shit. When they saw when when the natural when the, uh they wasn't even uh indigenous, but they understood what it was. You see, that's the shit that they brought. See, it's too much influence in that Sumerian. It's too much influence. You see, it's too much influence from up out of them, them mountains and shit. And so, yeah, the primary, the original, it, you know, was the Kushite. But, you know, that was like the first area in which, you understand, they conquered and they infused a lot. And so that was the first worship of the Cro-Magnum Neanderthal was that cabalism and that wit that witchcraft and shit that they brought up out their mountains. That's what they brought up out of there. They didn't have no Talmuds and no Torahs and no Qurans. And that's why even in the Islam, that, 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 you know, that, that witchcraft up under there, the, you know, and I, you know, we'll talk about the gins and you understand and flying on magic carpets and shit. And we'll talk about the Kabbalah and how the Kaaba, Kabbalah, and you know all them idols that they had in that Kaaba over there, that cube, the same cube that's on that goddamn Hellraiser, and you go over there tapping on that motherfucker, turning them goddamn, you know, turning them the cube and shit until you open up something you ain't got no goddamn understanding of what you doing. You see, so they didn't they slit these is these is demons. You see when they put this shit out here, but they trick you. It's always a trick. That's what make it magic to make you think you see something that you don't. To make you see something that you don't. And that's what you, you got to be clear of, you know, and that's why we come here to break the spell, you see. And so when you look at here, you see uh, this the early, you know, in the majority of them. Santa was the only motherfucker that, but you still hear it in his, you know, you know, he, 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 he say, oh, so be good. So be good for good. He sees you when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows if you've been bad or good. So be good for goodness sake. You know how they put that? Say, oh, you're better. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you better watch out. You see, you better not cry. You know. I'm telling you why. And then they show you that motherfucker with that goddamn switch. Sign up. We'll whoop your ass. Yeah. Yeah, they don't put that part in there. Yeah, Santa will whoop your ass, nigga. You ain't got your shit together. That's what they was doing. Every one of them, old, them earlier ones, Santa Claus walking around with the switch. You understand what I'm saying? Bell. And that's another one they don't talk about. Bell Nickel. Yeah, the other motherfucker that they don't talk about, Bell Nickel, who who was a or he's a, he's like an old man, old raggedy man. And they call him Bell Nickel. And so when you look at Bell or Ball, and then you see the nickel in there, which is Nicholas, but yes, yet and still is Nick. You see what I'm saying? So when you say in the old Nick, and you know, and then you know, and, and you see the Nicholas and shit. So that just show you right there how the devil is in the goddamn uh, saint. You know, he didn't manifest. And that's why you see him when he take the face off. Yeah, he'll be Saint Nicholas and this, that nigga. That's the devil, nigga. You understand what I'm saying? That's the devil up under there. So the, here it is. Santa Claus, he just going, he in there putting children in a, in, 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 in a, in a knapsack. And what they going to do? They're going to carry the kids off and they, and they parents just looking there. Looking at them and shit. You understand? They ain't even trying to help the kids. You understand what I'm saying? It's enough of y'all. Y'all can put work in on them niggas. Santa Claus and goddamn Black Pete. And see how they, they replace Krampus with Black Pete. You understand what I'm saying? They couldn't keep, you know, they, they couldn't take. See, the Christians, you know, you know, they tried to compromise with the, with the pagans over there in Europe. Krampus is really they, they deity. You see, that's really they deity. And so what they'll do is that, okay, we 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 gonna leave him out here. You understand? But we're gonna chain him up. And so you'll see that uh Santa Claus would have the chain 
You see, he would have a chain uh, uh, to show that the pagans had been conquered. That's why, you know, but Krampus is, they, is really their deity. You feel me? That's really their deity. And, you know, uh, but, you know, they, they, you know, they, they, he used to come out right there on St. Nick, on St. Nicholas Day. And he might still come out, but a lot of the Christians was like, they, they couldn't accept that, you know, even though they know that was their earlier worship, they couldn't. And so what they did is they moved it to the day, the night before December 5th and St. Nicholas Day is on December 6th. So they still got a, a day for Krampus. They still got a day for Krampus. And so I meant to do the one about where they got, you know, the Krampus night right over here. Man, they, it's like motherfucking Halloween and goddamn December. Man, it's like Halloween in December. They, they coming out. It's all over the United States. You know, I'm thinking that just, no, that shit all over the United States. They have, and they putting big money into that. You understand what I'm saying? And they really, you know, then brought that holiday into uh i mean it's big you know it's big they you know and you and all you can expect is for it to get bigger you see and so right here where you see you know you know they had Krampus. now they got goddamn uh uh black pete you see but they just show how they think about you they see you no different than the goddamn devil that's what it is they see you no different than the goddamn devil and so they got you chained up and they're going every goddamn uh, uh, St. Nicholas Day, they're going to uh, belittle you and dehumanize you. And you know what I'm saying? Man, please. And, and paint on black face and shit and this, that, and the third. Man, please. Motherfucker be out there dropping their ass. They'll have to change that shit. You understand what I'm saying? You got to make a motherfucker change his mind on certain shit. You can't just expect if motherfucker gonna be disrespectful to that. No, you you being overtly disrespectful. All in motherfuckers' face, painting their face uh, black and painting the li lips red and putting on little curly froes and shit. This, that, and the third man, motherfucker got to start tightening them jaws up. Motherfucker got to start going in them jaws and letting motherfuckers know you know how we feel. You know what I'm saying? And but this is what you engage in. You engage in this shit. This the kind of frequency, that, but that show you. That's why you ain't going no goddamn where. That's exactly why you, because you can't see reality for what it goddamn is. This ain't nothing for you, nigga. The hell you talking about? Let me let me come down here. I can't show you too much. I can't show you too much because some of this shit right here, you know. And, and and hear you. Look at this. See how they smooth the shit out in America? See. They show you the little Santa Claus and shit. Then they show you the baby. And then they show you Kronos. This motherfucker got a, a, a scythe in the back. This motherfucker got a scythe in the back. You understand? He's Kronos. And motherfucker ate all his, own, his children except Zeus. You understand what I'm saying? And he in there all demonic and shit. Look like he the baby is sitting up there on his lap. Ain't, ain't no telling. And look, you know, it looked like he got the goddamn calendar in, so you can't tell what's going on. You understand what I'm saying? And this shit is crazy. This the symbolism that you 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 identify with, you see? A damn a, a demonic god that eats his own children and they didn't smooth it out for you niggas. And he's in control of the years and shit. He's in control of time. You see? We gotta talk about this. We got to talk about this John, Johnus, the, the God of January, but rooted in his name is the gin, and I'm going to break the gin down. You understand what I'm saying? There's a, a secret understanding, an occult understanding, an esoteric understanding, but you got to understand it's two different frequencies. You see, it could be the same word, but it's two different frequencies. And you are operating under the uh, erratic frequency. You see, of the Cro Magnum Neanderthal. So you looking at this shit, right? This is another one showing. But this is right here is true to the where well, you see this is uh uh Father uh Father Christmas. See, Father Christmas is the British version. He existed before Santa Claus. Usually he would have on, he don't have on the he he would have on green and you know what I'm saying? But you see, 
Father Christmas. Say Happy Christmas. He putting it. He putting a child in the goddamn knapsack. You see, but see that's where you see Kronos in the back. You see Kronos in the back with the kids carrying them off. You see, you don't understand this shit. Santa ain't always been kind to children. The Santanillian origins of Santa. You see, you ain't you ain't breaking that shit down. You see, when you look at you see here the demonic in energy. You see, yeah, yeah. Krampus is binded by a Santa Claus, and, and is actually his shadow. Did y'all understand that? Krampus is binded by Santa Claus and is actually his shadow. Ain't that a bitch? Some say his twin, and that Krampus is the older brother. So you see the demonic energy in that. You see, and you see this motherfucker in the back. You can look in his eyes. It looked like he didn't just committed two axe murders. You see what I'm saying? And you going to, you know, they just show you. And you put your, and, and, and the traumatic, you know, you, that show you the frequency. That show you the frequency. You see right here, again. Now you see, now that's Bell's nickel. Now this motherfucker supposed to be delivering gifts? You going to have a motherfucker show up to your door, Bell's nickel? Man, please. Get the shotgun. You understand what I'm saying? We're going to show this motherfucker tonight. Bell Nickel. Oh, see, so you see the, ba the ball, the bell, L. You see, L is in everything. Man, they keep talking about Yahweh and, and all these other goddamn God. L is in everything. No L. You see, Bell Nickel and all the rest of this shit. The L's. Y'all don't, don't hear this shit? And you talking about some damn Jesus and some damn Yahweh and Jehovah. And L name is 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 more you know profound in throughout the religion, Judaism and goddamn Christianity. And you see him right there with a switch, and he didn't tie the damn child up to this is what kind of shit is this? Man, Christmas was child abuse. You understand what I'm saying? And in certain areas. You understand they banned some of this shit because they said that this shit is child abuse. They didn't ban the, the, the uh uh you know the parents from even telling the stories about some of some of this demonic shit. You see? And so yeah, and so you're talking about all this Noel and you know what I'm saying, and all of this shit. You hear L, what the fuck that in Israel. You see what I'm saying? And then and then you come and you find out this is actually a statue of hell, which shows that, you know, the influence. That's why I was telling people when people talk about the Phoenician, ain't no goddamn Phoenician. Phoenician is, is, is demotic Egyptian. That's what it is. There ain't nobody. All these goddamn alphabets come from from Africa. Every last one of them come from Africa. They, they are a, a derivative of the original alphabet. Okay, so when you see L, he got the A-Tef crown on like Osiris. He got the A-Tef crown on like Osiris. It is Osiris. So that's where you get L and this, that, and the third from. So that's how we know. All the way to Assyria, what they call uh, Nimrud and all of this. This is Egyptian. This is proof positive. Motherfuckers keep talking this bullshit when we put up facts. It could be easily proven. Go do your goddamn research. If I'm lying, goddamn it, go prove me wrong. Sick of you, nigga. Y'all niggas ain't ready for me. No, I come with the, the, the hard body truth. You see, Noel, and they tell you it's Christmas. That's French for Christmas. No, it ain't. Ain't no Noel. Noel is Noel. And no is was actually in the Bible was uh was the city of no was uh I believe why set Luxor. That's what uh, I believe it was. You got on in the Bible, which was Heliopolis. But I believe uh no was actually the city that they call Thebes. You see what I'm saying? Or uh, that's the Greek. Luxor is the Arab, and was Waset, you see, was the African. So you see right there in Noel, and you said. And we talk about the elves now. Nah? And then they go, and when you get in the French, they call him Papa Noel. Papa Noel. You see? Papa Noel. Father Christmas. 
Father Christmas. But who is Christmas? Noel. So you see, it goes back deeper than that. It goes, it, 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 it goes back farther than that. You know, we had, you know, the Canaanite guy, hey, oh, now this is on the, uh, this on the Cro-Magnum Neanderthal, you know, level, you see? And so, now this was one of the first uh, images that they, this was when they manifested Santa Claus as they have him today. You see, 1881, that shit ain't just came about. This is the first image in the Harper's Weekly 1881 where they made Santa Claus you see and I can go into that reef you know he got some of that good tree in that pipe too you know he up there yeah motherfucker crashed the goddamn uh the sled and everything fucked the reindeer up and every goddamn thing you understand what I'm saying he got them little hollies in his head and shit he look like he got one of them little demonic dolls in his hand yeah that motherfucker. And, you know, did y'all know that they, they used to say that Santa was an elf? Yeah, he was an elf. You know, but now they, you know, they don't say it as much. Now, I ain't going to get into none of that right there. See, this is all that good shit down here that I just ain't going to let. I ain't going to, I ain't you know that right there is off the chain. I can't even let, I got to go through that quickly. You see what I'm saying? You be in goddamn shop. And that just show you right there. They got all these crits. Christmas witches that y'all not even talking about. They, you go over there, they ain't got no Santa Claus. They still got them earlier icons over there. That's in Italy where they got uh, Lee uh, Bafana, Witch of the Epiphany. And so they got a witch over there. Now, I mean, imagine that. These supposed to be Christians and they over there with a goddamn witch. You understand what I'm saying? But, you know, you got uh, you got El Bafana, you got goddamn uh, 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 Frau Percha, you got a uh, Gryla, well, you know, and they ain't nothing but the female version of goddamn Krampus. You see, this is what's up under there. This is what's up under there. You see, and like I say, man, I got some jewels of information that I'm gonna pull out. You know, and 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 and, and take the information. I'm gonna roll right into New Year's, but I got one coming up on New Year. You understand what I'm saying? So if you, you know, I might do it that night. You understand what I'm saying? Fuck that. Cause I know you're going to be fucked up on, you know, by uh, a new year's day. I don't want, ain't, ain't going to be no trying to learn nothing. No, I'm going to have to get you before they, you know, you niggas start turning up that damn Hennessy and all that goddamn, yeah, all that, you know, Remy Ma. And I don't drink that shit. I stop. I've been stopped. You know what I'm saying? I drink a goddamn double deuce right now. Nigga, I'll probably be put my ass to sleep, man. You know what I'm saying? Once I stop fucking with that damn, you know, <laughs> you as you a, 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 as you get older and shit, man. You know what I'm saying? I can't even. I ain't gonna even lie. As I got older, I can't fuck with that shit like I used to, man. When I was young, we used to nigga. We'll turn up forties. You see what I'm saying? We be killing forties, nigga. We used to see how many niggas can turn. I'm just turn it up and see if a nigga can knock one down. You know what I'm saying? You know, shit, man. I can I can drink a motherfucking can. <laughs> My ass would be in there, nigga. Trying to get to the bed, nigga. I'll be in there trying to get to a bed, nigga. Thirty two right now, nigga. That's like our. A 32 or just Budweiser, so nigga, be like a goddamn, a, a half a pint of Hennessy for me. You see what I'm saying? I'm just being, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> nigga be sleep. But let's listen to me, family. It's going to be magnificent. I'm going to lay it out for the family. Make sure y'all click that link. Get your ticket, be in the house. Get the family in. I'm going to have it. I'm going to craft it. You know, when I say that, I'm going to craft it for the family. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be entertained, and I know they want to be entertained, and I'm gonna do that for them. I'm gonna, I'm gonna educate. I'm gonna entertain. You know, I got some visuals for them. You know, so it ain't gonna be just all. Oh, I'm gonna show you visuals. I'm gonna have some uh, animation. I'm gonna have you know cuts, clips from uh different uh videos and shit. So yeah, we gonna we gonna make. <laughs> Ray say I'm allergic to alcoholic drinks. Well, there ain't nothing wrong with that. You shit, you know what I'm saying? You had your day. You had your day if you was young and you niggas turned up, that was it. You know what I'm saying? It, but I ain't knocking nobody out there if y'all, you know, 
just do it you know in, in in moderation you feel what i'm saying don't let it overtake you so yeah family click that link begin to think i'll see you uh on the on christmas eve is that sunday so it do fall let me make sure yeah christmas day is on that monday you know what i'm saying and i'm gonna have a power pack i'm gonna be back on the 31st and so y'all you know just go to general city.ticketleap.com you'll see and believe me man that one on for new year's that motherfucker gonna be fire you see what i'm saying going into the new year i'm gonna have a lot of information on january janice leading into uh february lupercalia we going you know, we, we waking them up family that's what we supposed to do waking them up providing the information i provide the information but it's up to you to act on that information i thank you for being here today family i appreciate you and uh hit them links support your general and i, I might be back tonight just stay tuned I might be back. I don't think I'm done. I, I need to teach tonight. There's a general Sarah soon said he said, hey. You see Robert say, what'd you say down there? You and Top Cast are friends. Not friends. We ain't friends. No, we not. No, we're not. We ain't going to be friends neither. <laughs> we ain't going to be friends, dog. No, sir, Robert. We not. You know what I'm saying? 100. All right, family. This is a general Saab Rasul said. He said, hey, arm yourself with knowledge. Bang on that wicked ass beast daily. Liberation through African education and confrontation. Black pop.